every measurement. For fact's sake, Stuart, under President Biden, we've got more job gains, more economic growth, and new stock market records, including today, when the Dow closed mm -hmm. above 38,000 for the first time ever. And I haven't even mentioned how much oil we're pumping. Nancy Mace yeah, knows this. Nancy Mace's team knows this. So why does telling these lies work, especially on this kind of stuff? People can just look up their 401k. It's up. Look, this has become a, a Donald Trump talking point. Um, when you look, uh, a lot of these uh, Trump uh, endorsees now are coming out and saying this. Um, and it's, it's not a coincidence. You know, it, it makes perfect sense. Donald Trump has to say that his presidency was perfect. The same way he had to say that the phone call to Ukraine was perfect, that he had to say that uh, the election was stolen from him. You know, he can admit no wrong. But there are like certain very uncomfortable facts here. He's the first president since Herbert Hoover to leave office with more jobs. He increased the deficit more than any other president in history. He had the entire COVID disaster. I mean, you imagine being up on, on debate with Donald Trump. He won't debate. But, you know, if I was advising someone, I would say just like every couple of minutes, just say, like, bleach? Really? That was a good idea? Um, so I, I think it's a uh, policy, a, a political uh, strategy that's being driven by vanity and not by any sort of practical um, application. And I think it's going to be very, very tough to sustain this um, beyond that hardcore 39, 41% base that Trump has. Resolute Square.